Tiger has been dubbed Budweight 2.0 after a recent modest rebranding ad of Advances Bottles locales. Who asked for this? Um, nobody. But I just don't get why these major companies, like, and these major companies, they just think that Rope This is the super popular thing. From 2023 with the failure of Bud White, the, down, the tragic and huge massive downfall of Disney in 2023, where they only had one successful movie at the box office, and that was Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, okay? And of course, let's not forget about the whole thing of Target, and how that went, okay? But it seems that, you know, this year, okay, you had the downfall of the AAA gaming industry because of Sweet Baby Inc., okay? And now we have... Jaguar. So, Jaguar is a car company, okay, dubbed Budway 2.0 after releasing modest rebranding of Adrozis models, no cows. Again, who asked for this? And the backlash against wokeness is going to continue to get worse and worse as time goes on. I don't think wokeness is going to survive. It really is not. Okay. An ad featured as Roger Sparrow's with brightly colored over the top outfits of Queen Bird Bad Boy is resident at Rock of Other Sorgas says it's quite exorbitant, why vivid to reorder that way break rules. Yeah. Like, who, like, what kind of advertising is this? Let's advertise towards like 2 to 3% of the population at most who supports wokeness. Okay. Maybe you can say like half the population because half the population is liberal, but. Shortly after the ad premiered, X users piled into the company for releasing what they called a Budweiser 2.0 campaign to focus on wokeness and modernism over selling cows. I just don't understand why these companies just want to suit themselves in the foot. Okay? No one asked for this. Okay? No one asked for this. And this is going to continue to get worse and worse. Okay? And it's funny. They have they had boycotts, the ref did, and the boycotts failed. Okay? Remember in 2020 they tried to boycott the Goya food brand? Because the... And it's funny the guys endorsed Trump again in 2024. And no one talked about it because they failed the first time. Okay. That's made me want to sell my Jaguar and I don't even own a Jaguar. This is just the wrong time for I can understand in 2022 because of course that was before the backlash for woke this started. But in 2023, obviously, Wokeness had a massive backlash. Unbordered by taste, I see. For whoever your ad company is, this is not it. Congrats on not selling cows. A cow ahead of our cows. Hmm. And yes, that goes for I can see white marketing content team is important. You sell cows. Nothing in the ad tells a potential buyer about the story behind your products. What are takeaways from this ad? And, you know, even Elon Musk uh, responded. Do you sell cows? Okay. So, Jaguar has been completely roasted, completely destroyed, okay? Again, this is supposed to be, you know, this is a cow company. They're supposed to be advertising cows and selling cows. Announced in December, they will present Copy Nothing, where it describes as the first public, public installation for its new brand, include a post of modernizing, modernizing career philosophy, but who asked for this, Okay? Who asked for this? I just wonder. Who asked for this, you know, ad? <laughs> no one did. No one's going to be buying Jaguar cows, okay? This is a cow brand that you never see anywhere, okay? I have never seen a Jaguar. Or I see very real, real Jaguars sold, okay? But they're trying to advertise wokeness over selling cows, Okay? And that's what this video here. Goodbye.